The path of travel tool is used to determine the shortest distance between two points on a floor plan. This tool analyzes the geometry in the plan and goes around obstacles and through doors to optimize the route. The button, called Path of Travel, is on the Analyze tab of the ribbon. Like a typical detail line, the Path of Travel is view-specific and its line style properties can be changed from the Line Styles dialog. Select a Path of Travel to see its length and the time it takes to walk the path. Path of Travel lines can be named, tagged, and scheduled. The Path of Travel line can be used in a view filter. This example shows a view filter that will make any path of travel line red if it exceeds 80 feet, 0 inches. There is a Root Analysis Settings dialog, which allows for more control over which categories are considered obstacles, and in the Settings dialog is the ability to adjust the analysis zone, used by the path of travel to find obstacles within a top and bottom offset value from the views level. If any geometry from a model element is within the analysis zone, it will be considered an obstacle to the path of travel. The path of travel will be generated to avoid those obstacles and will calculate based on geometry inside of the crop region only. You can select one or multiple path of travel lines, and in the contextual panel of the ribbon, you'll see an update button. The help on this new feature contains detailed information on how the paths get generated and updated. Gain powerful insights into spatial relationships with automated time and distance calculations for smart space planning.